Hi, I'm Mike, and you're watching Heartbreaker Racing. I live in Maui, Hawaii with my beautiful wife Sarah, and I race a race car a dragster called Heartbreaker. I was born in Fresno, California. I knew I wasn't going to stay there. I lived in the Caribbean, uh, St. Thomas and St. John. Moved back to Denver, that's where I met Sarah. So growing up, weed was not around. It just, uh, you know, I was in Central California. My parents had government jobs. Then I got sick, I was 22. And I ended up with a really rare cancer stuck to the top of my heart. They had told me my options were do nothing. I'd probably 50-50 deal with it again. Do radiation of my heart and center area and 15% chance. Or I could do chemo and maybe a 2% chance of it coming back. They said three sessions of chemo, be over in three, four, five months. It's gonna suck, but then you shouldn't have to deal with it. So that's what I elected. So the doctor told me, he said, hey, he said, don't bring in a three foot bong. He said, but if you wanna twist up a joint, pull your curtain, nobody's gonna mess with you here. And Hawaii is a medicinal state, so I got a card for that. And that, again, really helps. It just really helps with the pain. It helps keep me calm and... Do you smoke every morning? Yeah. Do you smoke at the track when you race? first moved in, he couldn't believe how much we worked on the car. He's like, you're always working on the car. He's like, well, yeah, it's got to be perfect. You don't you mind the rubbing against the fence? We're not going to get it on this side of this thing here. It's not going to come. Man, I love it. You know, I love getting up there. I love hearing that. I love hearing that the sound of that motor. I love I love the smell of the rubber. It's, 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 it's awesome. I, I, can't, I can't really explain anything other than that. We're a team. Myself and Mike and Chris, our crew chief, and then everybody around us. I spent a day and a half already just cleaning, preparing, fixing up details. Not like it's a basket case. We won last month. We drove it on the trailer. So it's just about getting the details tightened up. And we got to work harder than everybody else. We got to make sure our I's are dotted, our T's are crossed. And uh, look out for a sportsman class. Rebuilt the motor, changed the radiator, coil, fuel pressure regulator, solenoid, just rebuilt the carburetor, replaced the transmission torque converter, painted the whole car, new shifter, new seat cover, new gauges, new steering wheel, few minor enhancements.